After a pair of dominating wins to start the Canada West season, in which the number three ranked Trinity Western women's soccer team beat Lethbridge 6 0 and Calgary 6 1, the Spartans are off to their most impressive start in program history. And as they enter this weekend, they'll do so with a ton of confidence as they host number eight ranked UBC right here at Rogers Field. I mean, anytime you can start your season 2 and 0, I don't think it really matters what type of competition you, you played against. We know that uh, we played some young and maybe some inexperienced competition in Calgary and Lethbridge, but you still have to play the games. And I um, thought we finished our chances really well, and probably that's given us a, a little bit of a boost of confidence because we struggled to score goals in preseason. And uh, we know that uh, the games down the road on our schedule will be uh, that much tougher. And um, you know, in, in many ways, like I've said, Canada West is always a tough conference, so it doesn't really matter which the next opponent is. Uh, it'll be a good game, and it'll be a fierce competition. It was kind of nice because last year we started with UBC, which is always our biggest competition, but having this week, kind of we were able to build our confidence and then always have room for improvement, which is what UBC is for. So we have our whole preseason set up for season. So to start off with Lethbridge and Calgary was a nice confidence booster, especially for our strikers and for everybody, and now it's time for real business, so it was good. And by real business, of course, that means facing off against UBC, a team the Spartans haven't beaten at Rogers Field since 2009, and one that is also coming off impressive wins last weekend, having beaten Calgary 5-1 and Lethbridge 4-0. Yeah, I mean, UBC, through the, the years that I've been coaching, it's always been the big rival, and um, I would expect nothing less on Saturday. We've, we've had tight games, whether, you know, they win 1-0 or we win 1-0 or... You know, we, we end up each with a point. Um, you know, we haven't fared as well against UBC in the last couple of years at home when I thought we've played well but never, never been rewarded for the results. So um, it, it'll be a good test. They're a good team. They've uh, returned a lot of veterans and they've added some very good talent. So uh, we know that uh, nothing, uh, nothing less than our best will, will give us a, a chance to play and uh, get a result. Uh, well, it's definitely time to prove something. I know. Like, we lucked out having them at home, so being able to try and beat that record, especially since I haven't been a part of any of that record, being, not being able to beat them. So um, I'm excited to finally break that streak and see what our team can come up with this season because we got new personnel, so it would be nice to be able to do it. I think they bring a presence uh, to the field and they close space well, and so I think that's what we struggle with, and they have, um, they have good uh, strikers, and so I think that's just something we have to deal with. I mean, their whole back lines together, um, very solid defensively. I mean, Mark is a very good coach and obviously was a great defender himself. And, um, you know, he'll have them organized and be tough to break down. But it's not just that. I think actually their, their weapons right now up front make them a very dangerous team. And they've showed in their first weekend they've, they've scored a, a ton of goals as well. So I'd say very even game. And uh, it'll be which team takes their chances, which team maybe gets the one lucky break, and which team maybe... Uh, doesn't make one mistake that gets punished, but um, you know they've got kids like Frizeo up front. They've got uh, Rachel Sawyer had a very good year last year, and I expect her to be even better this year. But you know we're a year older too, so um, hopefully don't count us out. Game time is Saturday at 5 p.m. right here at Rogers Field. For Spartans TV in Langley, B.C., I'm Mark Jansen.